I guess you could say this club car has undergone an unprecedented amount of makeover work. It's time for the season 2.5 finale of Extreme Golf Cart Makeover, right now on GCG TV. Hey, welcome back to Extreme Golf Cart Makeover. Remember, every day more people watch GCG TV than any other mammal. Today we're wrapping up our mini season 2.5 playlist with the final transformation on our 2015 club car precedent. And I call it final, but it does keep coming back like old rock band farewell tours. Safety first, we removed the keys, set the park brake, and switched from run to toe. We started this project by removing the rear seat kit before turning the cart around. Then we removed the front seat backrest and bottom cushion and took off the rooftop along with the rear support struts and SAM assembly. We had to tear down anything blocking the installation of the new vinyl wrap color before surface preparation. So we also removed the tail lights and took off the front clays basket and the windshield to make Nick's refinishing work easier. Then it was time to pull the camouflage vinyl that Nick installed in a past episode, which is a very satisfying feeling. At least for me. For Nick, it meant having to hear more of my camouflage dad jokes like, imagine our surprise when we took off the camo and found a golf cart under there. While also undoing hours of his very hard work, so I let it go. Then Nick got back to work by cleaning up the cowl and rear body and prep for the new wrap. We found a beautiful, high quality charcoal gray vinyl and I watched with a great deal of respect as Nick patiently and skillfully handled this tedious work. He says he finds it kind of relaxing or zen or whatever, but I think it might legitimately drive me crazy. Short drive. <laughs> but hey, at least I'll get there in style. Once Nick had time to smooth out the bubbles and final details on his surface refinishing, we reinstalled our windshield and seats. Then we moved on to some new rear top struts that connect to the arm bars of the rear seat kit to better support our new extended rooftop. A great tip for this project, if you're new to it, is to ensure that your rear seat kit, new struts, and extended top are all compatible. Getting them from the same manufacturer can really help with this, but as usual, if you have questions, Golf Car Garage is just an email or a phone call away. After ensuring we had our desired height dialed in on the struts, we bolted them in place and went to work installing our new extended top in black to bring the color scheme together and finally provide some coverage for the rear seat passengers on this cart. We'll make sure to link the new items we installed in the video description to make them easy to find. This precedent is going to put in some hard work taking a family of five on some fun adventures and they're going to have a great time. We love the way it came out and we hope against all odds and farewell tours that this time it stays this way. But we're looking forward to more makeovers and sharing more videos with you, so stay tuned. If you need help with your golf cart parts, diagnosis, tech help, or anything else, just stop by golfcartgarage.com or give us a call at 1-800-401-2934 so we can help show you around the garage. And hey, while you're here, give us a like and subscribe for more episodes. Thanks for watching. GCG TV.